Welcome back to my channel. Thank you all those people out in the media world, um, social media world, and coming back to look at my channel. Today we're doing something a bit similar, but it's a bit different. What's happened is Coles appears to have um, brought out a different product in the uh, Coles Kitchen Real Foods Fast range. They brought out a, uh, a classic beef, braised beef um, with um, uh, vegetables in a rich gravy sauce. In actual fact, it's a uh, larger version of the single meal. It's along the same lines. Um, but the difference is you get um, supposedly an 800 gram meal, estimated, in a big block. You see that? Big block. Big block, yeah. That weighs 800 grams, apparently, so they say. <clears throat> so, um, apparently it's also supposed to be for people. It also, now, the interesting thing here is that's supposed to see for, for people <clears throat> at $14. Um, so, effectively, you can serve two people on uh, $7 or one on $3.50. Um, so... Um, we don't know yet. We'll have to wait and see until I pull it apart and have a good look at it. But at any rate, um, it uh, goes on to suggest that it is a, a kitchen-inspired creation um, and it has it's cooked, so she's pre-cooked, and it's not frozen, but it's pre-cooked. <clears throat> uh, cooked, no um, added hormone Australian beef. Whatever the hell that's supposed to mean. Anyway, it's got water and carrots and tomato paste, uh, tomatoes and red wine. And um, but in actual fact, the reality is the uh, no added hormone Australian beef is only thirty six percent, and the rest is spread over the, over the others. Tomatoes four percent. Um, but uh, uh, that's it. Yep. Yeah. So. <clears throat> 36%, so 30%, 36% of this is beef, so which suggests to me there's really not much in there. But anyway, we shall see. And the calorie count, a calorie count is um, per serve, per 100 grams is 89 calories. Um, per serve, what they suggest, um, so that's, uh, so it's 800 um for, for four, so that's 200 per person. So a, a 200 gram meal, just this alone, is 179 calories. Um, the protein is up there. It, protein is 25.2 grams, whereas the carbohydrates is only 5.6. So probably not a real bad jet, a meal, but it could, again, it comes under the, uh, the heading of uh, the policy of Coles. Enjoy, love it, or your money back. And I've already done that once. Ordeal, but I got this um, because you're open to the interpretation of each law manager as to how the policy applies. But anyway, that's a whole new story or another story. Anyway, and to cook this little sucker, um, a bit complicated. This sort of you can do it in the microwave um, for seven minutes, and it says you pierce the lid. Make a hole in the membrane for um, and cook it for three and a half minutes on high uh, on the south of what microwave and on. Then after that, you pull pull this membrane back and you go, do it again another, for another three and a half minutes. But anyway, so with any uh, going any further, we'll she'll do just that. Okay, so. Done in the microwave. All right, let me give you a bow peep. It's coming out of the microwave. That's what it looks like. Um, yeah, that's a better view. Um, you can see beef, beef in there. You can see um, um, carrot, and yeah, that's it. Carrot. Uh, anyway, we'll wait and see. We've got to do the weight test, then we'll do the test, taste test. Um, one moment, we'll do that. 
the, the white. How, how well can you see it? Okay. <clears throat> so I'm to turn it on. Oh. Now, this is supposed to weigh 800 grams cooked. Well, wow. 185. Close. It's obviously not spot on. Um, it was a spoon. But we've got to admit, there's a nice, nice juicy piece of meat. Tastes alright. No, it tastes stringy. It tastes powdery. Well. Ah, my taste buds are going to be very disappointed with that. Well, I'm oh, not impressed. Um, what can I say? I mean, I'll, I'll try another piece of beef. Well, I've got to say, I'm disappointed, I really am. I expected more, I had greater expectations for this. The, uh, certainly it tastes stewy, like as in a proper stew, with a few vegetables, not many. Um, and, uh, but the meat, cubes um, are small. I mean, bloody hell. For something that's been pretty cooked, it's small. Well, I mean, I did a stew top down pork using um, diced pork yesterday. Yes. They started off bigger than what they were when it went in, when I finished cooking it. They did shrink, but not this bad. Um, so, <sighs> um, I'm not impressed. There's, um, there's more sauce, or stew sauce, than there is beef, and the carrots, there's very few. Um, so, I don't know. Um, I do not know. Um, this will be going back, I'd say. Um, well, why are we taking the food back? Um, it, just to make sure. Oh, yes, sir. Ah! Bugger me. Um, see, it says there. Try it, and I'll read it to you. It says, try it, love it, or your money back. Well, I tried it, I didn't love it, and I'll be going back with it. Because it's, and just to confirm with you people, if you have a Coles product with that slogan on it, um, you don't have to bring a receipt for obvious reasons, because by the time you get to use a product, it could be seven days down the track and you're throwing the dock it out, not assuming that the product's going to, you just can't keep the receipts. But they do say, bring the packaging, right, and proof. Now I'll take this video along um, and they can listen to it. And, um, but, sorry, my expectations have not been fulfilled. Um, now, I'm a, now I'm in a bit of a, don't know what I'm going to do for lunch now. That's what I was going to use this for lunch. I was going to do lunch and I was going to put it in one of these pockets. Or two, because there's two of us. Um, these are handy to have. These pockets. You can buy from all these all coals. Um, they're put out by um, Mission. So anyone that sells Mission products, you should be able to get these. No, these are a good standby. So, anyway, 
based on what I've just tasted, based on what I've just seen, for 14 bucks, I would have been better for bloody McDonald's. Um, no, I, a yummy, delicious score. Uh, I hate to say it, um, I'm going to give it a full crap. It's all sauce, hardly any meat, and certainly hardly any vegetables. Um, I suppose I've just resurrected this, but I shouldn't need to. I mean, it's what it's designed for, and it's not. So yeah, I'll stick to my four. It's um, been let down. I've been let down yet again from a product um, which is supposed to be new. Um, I thought, ah, great concept, great idea, versatile, rah rah rah, and there's just no real body in it. There's nothing to work with, just except for sauce. And if it's going to be well. All right, so they're saying 36% is a beef. The rest is what else, else goes in it. And I think, from memory, the vegetables, 4%, which included the carrots and the tomato paste and the tomato um, and carrots, and, and the rest is sauce. So, so 40% of it's going to be the main product. So 60% is sauce. What else can you do with that? Oh, what a major disappointment! Oh, it's crap. It's $14 worth of nothing. Um, no, it's a pull. It's a failure. And I'll be taking it back to, to Coles and say, sorry, it's no good. So, on that, day, on that note, I'll bid you adieu. And don't forget, stay safe. Well, come back and see the channel, of course. And I look forward to you coming back. And stay safe. Share this with friends, family, or anyone else you think might be interested. Um, through, share it through Facebook, through Messenger, whatever. But whatever you do, keep coming back to see the new videos and we'll see what I find. This is the whole point of doing these videos so I can work out or I'll let you know what the product's like before you buy it and you can make a decision on your own. <clears throat> if you want to buy it, by all means go buy it. But from my point of view, this will be the first and last time I buy this product. Um, and I urge that you don't because you're wasting your money. Um, there's many other better products on the market for lesser money. And anyway, on that note, like I said before, share it, subscribe, hit the like button, leave a comment if you like, and you stay safe and uh, we care. So you come back to see the channel again. And adieu.